This has been a project that's long overdue. The restroom just doesn't meet the needs of the park anymore. We're excited about the design in that it blends with the aesthetics of the other buildings in our Pioneer Park and Downtown Civic Center. We'll have five stalls in the women's restroom. The men's will have two stalls and four urinals. We will also be adding two family changing rooms that families can use to change clothes after they go to the spray park or just for more privacy. When you look at renovating a public facility such as this one, it's not just your standard porcelain sinks and toilets. It's all the facilities underneath, surrounding. With increasing the size of the restroom, you ultimately have to increase the size of the utilities that service that, which means we basically have to replace the entire sewer system that provides service to the building. The construction budget for the restroom is $1.7 million. A large portion of the funding for this project came from a state lift grant. What that is is a local infrastructure financing tool. And we actually received $1.5 million as far as allocating towards this project, so it's covering a significant portion of the project cost. When we're building a facility like this, especially a public restroom, they are one of the hardest used facilities when it comes to public facilities. And so ultimately we wanted to put materials on the building that can not only withstand the expected use of it, but also outstand the test of time. When all of this work is done, the restroom will be larger, be able to manage the number of people that are using it during the summer and peak time, and will be up to current code. We think this is going to be a great addition. In the long run, it's going to be worth the wait.